At the end of each nine-week marking period, and if you're a high school teacher, the end of the semester, you'll need to post your grades to the SIS. There are just a few steps required to post your final grades, which involve checking your gradebooks to make sure that no students are missing grades, and then posting your final grades where you enter conduct scores for your students. Near the end of each marking period, the grade posting window will open. And when you are permitted to post your final grades, you'll see an alert in the alert section. Once you see that alert and your grades are ready to go, you're ready to post your final grades. The first step in posting your grades is to run a report that allows you to check one gradebook or all your gradebooks for any students who are missing scores for assignments. Every student must have a score for each of your assignments before you can post your grades. To access this report, select on Grades, Gradebook Reports, and then select on Missing Grades. The Missing Grades report allows you to enter grades for any of the missing grades that it displays. And you can cycle through your classes to access additional gradebooks, or you can select on Show All Courses in the upper right-hand corner, and you'll see all of the missing grades in all of your classes. Any missing grade must be corrected before you can post your final grades. Once all your gradebooks are in order, you'll be ready to post your final grades. To post your final grades, first select the class that you wish to post for, then select on Grades, Post Final Grades. To retrieve the grades that you've stored in your gradebook, select on Use Gradebook Grades, and then verify that you want to use the grades that you've stored in your gradebook by clicking on OK. Once you do this, the system will calculate the final grades and fill out the field for the grades. The next step then is to assign a conduct value for each of your students. These follow the same 4 through 1 conduct scores that the district has been giving out for many years, and you'll select those and ensure that each student has the correct conduct score. Once your conduct scores are entered, select on the Save button and look for the verification that you finished posting final grades for this marking period for this class. You can then proceed on to the next class and repeat this process. If you're teaching a high school class, and you have semester exam scores to record, you'll do that through a separate process. After the nine weeks grades have been posted, you can select on post final grades and then use the semester exam button at the top of the window to choose your current semester. Then enter the semester grade exams for your students. If you are teaching a course where there is an end of course exam administered by the state, you will not submit semester exam scores. As always, remember to click Save to save your work and post your final grades. Once all your final grades have been posted, you can print out the grade verification sheet that your administration will want you to sign. Check with your administration on exactly how to handle this, but to print that report, select on Grades, Posted Grades Verification Report, and you'll have a detailed report of the grades that have been submitted by you so that you can sign and present to your administration following their instructions. Finally, in the event that you have a grade that needs to be changed for a student and the posting period for grades has elapsed, you'll need to request a grade change through the system. To do this, select on Grades, Request Grade Change. With the class selected where you need to make a change, select on the student who requires a change, select on the term that requires a change, then when you see the current grade letter appear, you can enter a new grade letter from the drop-down, enter an explanation, then press the Enter key on your keyboard. This will record your request and the appropriate administrator will be alerted that they need to take action on your request. As you've seen, posting final grades from the gradebook is a process that requires just a few steps. You'll need to verify that every student has a grade in every assignment. You'll post your grades. You'll print verifications of your grades. And you'll request grade changes as necessary all within the SIS.